tonight. An agreement was reached between Bicknell officer officials and the Knox County Sheriff's Department. The agreement will help provide law enforcement protection to the city of Bicknell. Demetrius Sanders was at tonight's Bicknell City Council meeting and he brings us details on what this agreement means for safety in that area. Demetrius. Mike Sadie, by a vote of four to one, the Bicknell City Council passed an interlocal agreement that would allow for the Knox County Sheriff's Department to help patrol the city. But it was a decision that many were not pleased with. After their police chief was charged with battery and another officer was accused of sharing confidential information that put undercover officers at risk, the city of Bicknell was left with two officers to patrol the city. Monday, after a vote from the Bicknell City Council, an interlocal agreement was approved that will allow for the Knox County Sheriff's Department to help the city with patrols. The interlocal agreement states that you know we will retain one officer here who will cover uh, mostly day shift operations. Uh, there will be the opportunity for him to move around based on various needs of the community. In addition to keeping one officer, beginning on January 1st of 2020, the city of Bicknell will pay the Knox County Sheriff's Department around $320. $26,000 a year for three years. That money will be used to hire four new deputies to help with policing Bicknell. In exchange, the city of Bicknell will transfer some weapons and vehicles to the county. The prevailing wisdom is that a good agreement is one uh, where someone had to give up something. And I think that that's what happened here, and that's why I think the agreement's good. While Estabrook believes the agreement is good, many community members at Monday's meeting spoke out against it. Tell them that they're not safe. I will not say that. that this is not what we need. We need actual law enforcement, train people. And Garlic says she does have safety concerns following the agreement. My concern is our response time. Everybody is not unaware of all the shootings that happen. All right, what is it going to take for it to happen here at North Knox? Until the agreement is finalized, Knox County will continue to help Big Bignall, and the city has agreed to pay the Sheriff's Department just under $23,000 a month for their services. The city will receive a $50,000 credit for their agreement to transfer vehicles and weapons to the Sheriff's Department. Sadie? Demetrius, what are the next steps for this agreement to be finalized? Sadie, according to Estabrook, it must be passed by Knox County Commissioners and County Council.